I wish I was as skinny as I was when I thought I was fat. It's Scarlett and welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be talking about something I've wanted to talk about for a long time but I kind of shied away from talking about it because I just didn't want to keep drawing attention to it and I think it's because I still felt a level of insecurity myself and I didn't want to draw too much attention to it. But I've gained weight and I've spoken about it in my videos a few times but I didn't want to keep talking about it because I just, I, I don't think I'd really come to terms with the fact that I'd gained weight and that was what my body was going to be like for a while. And as you guys can probably tell with my posts and everything, I'm really starting to feel so much more comfortable with my body and happy with my body. And I want to talk about something that has plagued me since I decided, I, I think for a long time, and that is just wishing I was as skinny as I was when I thought I was fat. What really brought this up is that I've been really nostalgic and looking back on old pictures and videos of myself from the ages of like 16 to 18 when I like first lost the weight and I was just feeling fresh and feeling on point and not even just to the age of 18 to be fair until I was like 20 um things were like popping for me personally that's what I thought anyway uh well what I think now that's the important thing to say is that looking back on it now I'm like wow my body looked amazing I was so toned I was so muscular I just looked amazing and when I remember how I felt about myself in those pictures and videos I still thought I needed to make progress I still thought that I still needed to put more work into my body because I didn't feel like it was where I wanted it to be and it was crazy because I used to look at pictures of other people and be like I hope one day I look like them and I hope one day I look as good as them and then looking back at the pictures and then looking back at these people I'm like scholar you looked just as good as them in terms of I looked like the body types were very similar for the look I was going for basically and that was a very toned slender kind of look that I was going for at the time and it is crazy to think how I just didn't see that in in some ways I genuinely thought I was fatter bigger whatever word you want to use and when I use the words fat and skinny it's just I'm using those words because those are the words we're all, all familiar with I know people don't feel comfortable with those words they think they're degrading they're not right both of them in their own right so I completely understand that but I just to put the point across I'm using those words but I completely understand if you guys aren't a fan of those words because they're not the best words and they're usually used in the negative connotation. I hate that I felt like that. I am so annoyed with myself that I continuously let myself feel that way and even some days now I have days where I'm like looking back at these pictures I'm like oh my goodness I wish I was as skinny as I was when I thought I was fat but then even in this moment I still think Scholar you need to make a little bit more progress you need to get back to where you were and I'm like shut up like shut up stop thinking this way like just be happy in the way that you look and I want to get this message across to you guys as well because I bet a ton of you guys have done this where you've like slated your body, not liked it, and then one day you don't have that body anymore. You don't look anything like that anymore and you're still feeling the same way no matter what your body looks like or how it changes and that is why I continuously try to push the message of self-love no matter what your body looks like. It is fine to want to lose weight, it is fine to make progress, to want to get stronger, more muscular or anything like that but do not hate on the body you currently have because you will regret it. You will regret it. You guys have no idea how much I regret the fact I didn't just enjoy my body that I had from the ages of like 16 to 18 and just enjoy the way I looked and just enjoy it till it's fullest amount. I just wish I'd let myself do that and it's not even that I wanted to look like that again exactly. In fact I don't actually to be honest with you guys. If you're like scholar do you want this body again I'm like actually nah. My body has changed in many ways and a lot of those ways are because I've become a woman so I can't expect myself to look like I did when I was 16. We've got a little bit more junk in the trunk, a little more thigh edge going on and that is okay and I've come to terms with that and I'm happy with that and I love it now and I just want you guys no matter what stage you're in right now just to know that one day you're gonna want to look the way you did now whether you're older and you're like oh man my skin is all wrinkly and stuff like that because it's natural and it's human and humans are always gonna have an idea of perfection in their head and that's never gonna go away that's why I'm like it's okay to want to lose weight it's okay to want to get muscular and toned whatever your desires are just know that you need to be happy with the way you look now and just be comfortable with it and love yourself and don't be apologetic don't stop yourself from wanting to wear something you want to wear 
there. Don't stop yourself from doing something you, you wanna do, whether it's go swimming with your friends. Don't be insecure about what you might look like in that bikini or that swimsuit because you're just gonna regret it one day if you hold yourself back. Like, it is so ridiculous to me that when I was 16 to 18, I still found it difficult to wear like shorts. And I'm looking at my legs now and I'm like, those legs were on point. What were you talking about, Scholar? And even now, I'm like, uh, I don't really wanna wear shorts. I mean, the main reason I don't wanna wear shorts now is just cause they'll ride up and then you'll just get that like really annoying thing. I mean like, who can actually wear shorts without them riding up? Like really, someone please tell me. Or can they create shorts that just don't ride up like that? Cause it's so awkward. I'm going on a tangent, but you get what I mean. Um, just be happy with yourself. And I'm just sick and tired of the fact that I, I felt like that. And even some days now that I feel like that because I know I will regret it because my body will change again and I'll be like, oh, I wish I looked like that again. And it's just so annoying. And I'm sick and tired of it. I don't want this anymore. This is why I've been so positive and owning my weight gain. Like one of my goals is to stop finding offense when somebody points out I've gained weight. Yes, guys, I have gained wait like my butt is really big right now my thighs are really big right now but they're not even that big and it doesn't even matter if they are big like what does it matter like it does not matter as what matters most is that I am healthy and I am happy and I can assure you that I am both because I am still out here working my butt off but not quite because it's still there and that's okay eating healthy having fun I'm still doing it just not to the same effect that I was before my body is running differently and that is okay and I want to make this video now because I'm about to start a training schedule where my body might change again I'm training for a marathon eventually in October and I have a 10k race coming up in four weeks and I just continuously have races and active things that I'm doing where I had to train harder because I'm just a competitive person and I want to continuously push myself harder so my body is gonna change whilst I'm training for those things it might not change I don't know but I just want to tell you guys that now because I don't want you guys to see my body change in the next few weeks and think ah she was talking about being thick and young and luscious but she didn't really believe it because she went and lost weight anyway she went and changed her body anyway she got more toned and anything like nah it was just part of my training schedule is changed now that is all I have hyped myself nobody else came to me and said wow you have a great body or you look good like if you sit there and tell everybody you have a great body they will believe it they're like oh really like that is how trends are created somebody sits there and goes i like it and if they keep saying they like it enough people will be like actually yeah they're right like some people are just that fickle i'm that fickle like there are some things that i just really don't like but if enough people say they like it i'm like oh okay i like it too i mean it depends what it is like it's not like oh if everybody said i love poop i wouldn't be like oh yeah actually yeah, i love poop too actually i don't know you never know yeah just please hate on your body less and keep making an effort to do so because I'm so happy I am where I am now and gaining weight might have been difficult for me because I did put effort into losing weight and I did prefer the look I had when I lost weight and the feeling I had when I lost weight and I'll be honest with you guys but now I love myself way more that my body looks the way it does because it, I have a newfound appreciation for just loving my body no matter what it looks like, no matter how it feels like. My body still runs, it still does everything I need it to do. There's so many things I wanted to say, like oh, the list goes on, but I'm just gonna stop it here and just end it. I think maybe if you guys really like this topic, comment down below and then straight after this video goes live, I will do an Instagram live and we can talk about this topic more because I had so much more I want to talk about but I kind of like I don't want to make this video super long so if you guys are up for an Instagram live video after this video goes live comment down below and as soon as I see people interested I'll go live so you can just go and check out my Instagram and see me live there but anyway I'm really gonna leave you guys now so thank you so much for watching stay healthy stay luscious and I'll talk to you guys later bye